welcome this is the energy vibration reading for all Virgo Sun Moon and Rising sign and I want to say thank you to each and everyone who is going to be connecting with me on this video um, this is going to be a wonderful week it's the last week of July 2017 and I want to say to each and every person please be open up to the energy vibration of this week because it's going to be a week of transformation it's going to be a good week whatever that was blocking you is going to be released it is the week of the Emperor the Emperor comes in to bring you um, balance and focus and achievements and success um, it's more of a balance week it's more of a cleansing week we have the devil and the tower twice and it is blowing up everything so your number is going to be um, 16 16 1 and 16 16 1 6 1 6 and 16 1 6 and 16 1 6 and 16 okay your focus is going to be the Queen of Cups. So whatever is happening, the energy of the Queen of Cups, you, some of you are going to take on the energy of the Queen of Cups. It is a week, a fire week, with a zodiac energy of also fire because it's, 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 it's pumping fire. It's, it's, it's a week where you have to find your inner passion. So you're going to go out there. It's, it's pumping. You're going to go out there. Um, it's a week where you're going to really find inner, inner passion. Okay? Um, okay, as we look at your week, it's going to be a week of transformation. And uh, uh, on Monday, we have a fire energy, the devil. And this is, as you know, whenever the devil comes in, is um, for some people, it's really people working their negative energies, uh, blocking you, holding you as bondage, holding you in bondage. It's you want to, you know, you can't do your diet because you keep on going back you're breaking your diet it's you not finding the discipline to do something and get up and go do something or get up and leave something or you know but it's it's, it's like and your ego is bonding you to something that you need to release yourself from and it's going to happen because we have the energy of the tower so this is good this is extremely good whenever we have the devil and people who are working their negative energies to keep and block other people that they get a universe always come in and blow it down no matter how long it takes the universe always stand in and said this is it because you know sometimes we're not aware of what is going on sometimes we're going about our lives and we're wondering why is this and this and this and this and this and this but there are other people's be you know and it's always people who are very close to you who are people who just see you and decided that you should not um you know have what you have and they don't know how hard you have to work for it so this is what is happening but whatever is happening the tower the energy of the tower the universe is going to come in and make and cleansing it's going to remove all these negative people out of your life and this is good on Tuesday we have the energy of uh, the, the energy of water and the energy of water is the nine of cups I love this energy of the nine of cups and this nine of cups is bringing your wishes and dreams true but with that you have to have inner strength because it's you know your wishes and dream if you were wishing for something you can't just wish for it you have to wish think about it say this is what you want and you have to go and work towards it and this is what you need to do is to go and work towards whatsoever that as been happening and this is extremely good okay as we move forward we're looking at the energy vibration of the two of Pentacles and what is happening for the two of Pentacles is that we're having a positive we're trying to balance our emotion but yet still our financial situation but whoever that was holding us and keeping us as a burden is now being released okay so if you had financial burden like you think oh my god I gotta pay that I gotta pay that oh my god you know the sort of a thing you're gonna see this changing you're gonna see that uh, 
you are facing up to whatever you know your financial burden is you're facing up as to whatever your emotional unbalance is and you're trying to balance most of both of them because if your emotions if your financial situation is in balance uh, that means you have no more burden okay so once you balance your financial situation you will balance your emotional situation and you're going to see that you have absolutely no more burden so this is good you know whenever the negative energies comes up and the voices that comes up and telling you all of these uh, just say um, you know I'm releasing you to the pure light you know I want to just be positive and keep positive thoughts on Thursday something is going to happen you're going to find out that someone tried to get away with something and it can be that someone is copying your work or that sort of a thing and trying to get away with it but it's not gonna work I'm not gonna work people don't do it to other people do not try to do things and think you can get away with it because you can't get away with it whatever you know if people decide you know sometimes people can just meet you and decide that you, you are not going to come out better than I am that sort of a thing and they will try to block you or try to end it end you from um, receiving something if it's in your blueprint there's no way it's gonna happen and even if they try and they think they succeed this is one of the time it's not going to happen because on Friday you are going to realize that the tower comes out the tower came out on Friday so whoever was trying to get away with something it's not going to happen because the tower comes out and with the energy of the tower coming out you're going to see something unbelievable because with the tower coming out and blocking that person and taking away this is the second tower you are seeing coming out you are going to have a cleansing a wonderful beautiful cleansing that is going to help you to move yourself forward and you're going to find your inner strength and find that that light within you and with finding that light within you on Friday you're going to feel yourself vibrating at such an high energy you're going to realize that you can move on with your life whatever that was happening is the second time I'm seeing this in this energy vibration reading that this um, page of sword which is not one of my favorite cards is in the reverse and this is good so whoever that was trying to get between the lovers whoever this person that was lying it can be um, the energy of an Aries um, it can be Aries um, of it can be Aquarius Gemini or Aquarius Gemini or uh, Libra whoever this person was who was trying to get in between the lovers and the lovers can be a couple the lovers can be friendship they can the lovers can be good friends you know and you you are always have a somebody lying and trying to bring news to the other person to make chaotic situation happen between people whoever it can be the energy you know wh whoever this person was they're no longer there anymore to do this okay because you will never you'll be amazed to know the things that go through people at at sometimes and what was happening is that whosoever this person was this Aquarius Gemini or Libra in person who was trying to get between the lovers it's not it's no longer going to happen um, there is an end that is coming towards it okay as we look at Sunday it is an fire the passion and this is good because you're finding the inner strength to fight off negative forces this is perfectly perfectly good negative forces are people who are naysayers people who don't want to see you survive people who you know want to just always in an argument with you that sort of a thing and you're fighting these people off and by fighting these people off, someone you're you know this the women the men and the women are going to be fighting these people off but for the women you guys are going to stand up fight them off and stand up and say no to the air and not further you know the men are going to be laid back and think you know let me just walk away from this and say and the women are going to stand up and said no no longer this is not going to happen I don't need any of this bullshit in my life sorry <laughs> but this is what you Virgos are going to stand up for in this week and it's going to be good because you're carrying the energy vibration of the 
queen of cups but yet still you're fighting off and you're saying no to certain things you're keeping you know negative forces at bay and this is going to be good so let's look back at your week um your week whatever that was happening your wishes and dreams you want to um bring in your wishes and dreams and the energy of the devil the people that was working against you the energies that were working against you the negative people who were working against you who didn't want to see you prosper uh, the, the the energy of the tower comes and it's going to remove them out of your life which I profoundly found that this is a wonderful energy whoever you are whatever that has been going on it's going to come and remove them out of your own energy vibration and you're going to start seeing changes in your surrounding and people you're going to start attracting the right people Whoever that was lying and bringing news um, and, and watching a, a relationship and people in a relationship, it's going to come to an end. You know, they're going to just, you know, it's, it's, it's as if, no, I don't, I don't want to deal with you. I'm not going to deal with you. And you're going to move them out of uh, who you are. It's as if they kind of give up and, and realize that, you know, um, whoever these two were, they are really good people they're on the right track uh, they are doing positive things uh, and endeavor so you know this is what is going to um, happen and in the second half of the week you you know in the second half of the week is crowned by the seven of sword and the seven of sword is someone trying to get away with something but you know whenever you feel as if some people are lying and they're trying to get away with something you call upon you know just say I'm calling upon the universal angels my guides and angels my spirit guides my animal guides for divine intervention in whatever is going away and going on do not let whosoever is trying to get away with something get away with it you need to call upon the universal angels and ask them so that whoever it is do not get away with it because it can be it has something to do with work and somebody want to get away with something but call upon the universe and angels and guides and say whatever the situation is you know my heart you know what happened and I'm asking for divine intervention in this situation and you're going to see the changes that will come out again you're trying to protect yourself from whoever just as try to do something it can be your work or that sort of a thing so be aware of what is happening because whoever that was trying to get away with something it's not going to happen because you're keeping them at bay and the tower energy comes up and whatever it comes up the tower energy comes up and you're regaining your strength and your inner light it's as if someone wanted to take away your strength and inner light and you're regaining you're regaining that back I love these cards because look you know I can know when the angels are around because they always change the vibrational energies of the card which is so positive so whatever is happening in this week you know that you're divinely protected and divinely guided and you know just say you know you don't have to say it aloud you can just keep on saying it keep on thinking it and saying it and um, you're going to see that this is just going to be working out positive. It's going to be a week of transformation, a lot of transformation. You're working on your wishes and dreams to make it be positive. You're seeing positive energies. You're seeing positive things coming in your life. And yet still, you are going to find a way to keep them flowing in your life in this week. Okay. I'm asking the abundance universe what the message you would like to give the Virgos in this week and this is a beautiful card this is really a beautiful card let's see what the message is and it says you want what you want because you know it's possible if it wasn't you wouldn't this is a powerful embracing it for whatever else you believe or don't believe, this belief alone can take you the distance and what you want, you want now. And that is so true. Once you believe in something, once you think that, you know, I know I can do good at this. I know I'm good at this. I want to do this. How do I, you know, get 
to where I would like to go and then you're going to see that doors of opportunities are open up it's as if you know you know I know I could do um, something and you know I'm good at this and I want I wonder how just call upon the universe and ask the universe to send you in that direction because you know where it is so you know you want what you want because you know it's possible if it wasn't possible you wouldn't this is powerful embrace it for whatever else you believe or don't believe this belief alone can take you the distance so whenever you believe in something whenever you know that you know this is something that I could do and I could make a living for it and I I don't want to work for people I want to work for myself I know I could do well and you have that hold that and go for it okay the F word <laughs> okay we have the F word okay whatever okay let's see what is the f word people we have the f word number 30 the f word okay i told you last week i always like using the funny card the f word nobody likes the f word but the dude sees forgiveness through a different pair of glass he knows that everything is going to turn out fine in the end and that holds on to negative and odd wounds is just postponing the inevitable your success is a done deal your bliss is gonna happen the forgiveness the F is the mean forgiveness the forgiveness word the F word is the place to start let it go forgive forget and follow the yellow brick road okay this is profoundly wonderful and I'm going to read it again so the F word is forgiveness okay the F word is forgiveness it says nobody likes the F word but the dude the source creator sees forgiveness through a different pairs of glasses he knows that everything is going to turn out fine in the end and that holding on to negativity and odd wound is just postponed and the inevitable to happen your success is a done deal your bliss is gonna happen the F word forgiveness um, is the place to start let's go forgive forget and follow the yellow brick road forgive forget and follow the yellow brick road okay I do not 100% I think okay I forgive you but I'm not going to forget it you know and I'm you know in that sense I am really um, I, I, I will forgive you but I'm not going to forget what you do because if I forgive you and forget I let you do it to me again so I'm gonna hold you at bay you know so I don't know how you see that you know it says forgive and forget and follow the yellow brick road but I forgive people but I don't forget because when you forget they it, these things will happen to you again I want to say to each and every person I love you I'm sending you love and light and I am um, um, I'm asking you to please like share these videos thumbs up and if this is your first time please subscribe and I'm saying to you namaste until next week